scores of protesters in the group Coalition of La Association Scholar, together with journalists covering the demonstration by the group, were assaulted by military officers who were at the Kulichu land. According to the group, the protest was against the encroachment of Las two lands by the military. Soldiers used clubs, horsewhips, and guns to beat up members of the group who were demonstrating and later attacked media personnel who were also at the scene. Some of the protesters who were beaten by the military personnel narrated their ordeal to City News. <laughs> cemetery no na ba je la una ho anya ho anye e wa no ne hwe government dey nche ke ka ye easter na ta e si ese he secretary ababo wa mani e ke ka ye easter ta within one or two weeks time i release wa shipon awo ko ni hejo la ba wo ya ke wa nu wo ya wo shipon yi wo te wa do mo shi shi ben wa ko ya ke lori ameke lori pi e ba number 4 eh angle triangle ne ke ah me ko na me nya wose ble 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 na me move 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 be ken ken me ko me la o bla yan bi en la a la ke ni bi move move mo nya fu e ma jo wa ni gbe shi ni te se ko de ke cho chance no na lori ko ke papa ko ni a boto lori e mi a me jo lan cho am so yin no so yin ni ke ni ni cover him be ni ke cho e twan ko ni gbe lo le wa ni gbe shi ni na no na ke twan suo o na na ke twan bi e o yin Addressing the media on the matter, MP for La Dadekotopon, Rita Na Odole Soa, condemned the brutalities by the military and called on government to resolve the long standing impasse. I believe most of you have seen the people that were assaulted. Some of the media men and women were also assaulted. And I don't think this augurs well for us as a nation. And so as a member of parliament for Dade Kotopon, I wish to condemn this act. And I'm calling on the government, the Minister of Defense, the Minister of Lands, and the government, the states as a whole, and Lands Commission to come together for an amicable solution or settlement between the people of La and the Ghana Armed Forces. And I believe the people of La, we are a peaceful citizen, a peaceful people. When we sit down well and we dialogue, there's going to be peace because we have lived with them um, for all these years over the period. And so whatever the negotiations are, governments should come clear on it to make sure that we have peace within our walls. Meanwhile, the Ghana Journalist Association, GDA, has also condemned the act. It's unfortunate, but we will hold a fire until the findings of the investigations are released. And if you are not satisfied, we will express our outreach. If you are satisfied, we will applaud the military for doing the needful.